got to show off my banana. <laughs> okay. Hey, everyone. On that good note, happy Friday again. Guess what? I'm back. From the cabana. That's right. I didn't say I got to say happy Friday oh, from sorry. the cabana. Go ahead. Happy Friday from the cabana. From the cabana. Guess who's here? Look who's here. Yeah. It's I'm Mr. Back. Devin. I'm back. What does that mean, ladies and gentlemen? Because now, mind you, there is a possibility you could get some of this in the U.S. I don't know. I didn't look it up. But... As, as some of you know, both of you, uh, the Fetching Mrs. and I went to Bali. Yes, and I watched those videos, unfortunately. <laughs> and I got some booze to bring back. It is called Arak. 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 See, Arak. Uh, let me grab my glasses. And it has some Indonesian language. Yeah, it's legit. It. It's legit. Gu uh, Guan Hu. Is that the brand? Is no Arak is the is the name. Look it up. Look All right, it up. Arak is the name of the alcohol. No. Um, what is Indonesian Arak? Arak. 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 I'm pretty sure that's how it's pronounced. Typically, Arak. the cheapest local spirit available. Well, I'm glad to know that I rate high. No, 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 no. But here's here's the point. Unregulated. Oh, this is fantastic. This is no. This has got numbers on it. Okay, we'll see. Uh, what is it? Uh, it's actually an Arabic word used... Wait, what? Arak. I got, I got this in Indonesia. I know. It's used Wait. as a generic term for a variety of spirits in many cultures. Okay, Okay, we so, don't want to read everything. That could, this could be a very boring video if we read the whole thing. Uh, Point is, this is the local drink. And so I wanted to bring some back home. Locals are often encouraged to make bootleg alcohol... Due to strict laws and high taxes. Is that why this costs so much? Can sometimes contain methanol, also found in paint thinner and wiper fluid, a highly toxic form of alcohol that causes blindness, coma, and death. What the hell did you... Are you trying to kill no, me? No, no, not every, not every, Eric. You, you gotta make sure you get it at a, a reputable place. Let me look up And this. I asked Booty, because... Booty. Who's Booty? Booty was my booty is always my guide, really, when you get down to it. But that, that but that was that was her name. Is Booty? It's spelled B U D I. Oh, Booty! Don't go there, you. But it was always fun. Whenever she'd show up, I'd say, "Booty in the house." Ah, yeah, that good? yeah that's good. Booty in the house. Yeah. Booty in the house. Yeah. yeah. And think so she's a rapper now. Do rappers do that? No, oh, I'm sure they do. Oh, anyhow. Um, uh, oh yeah, what I was gonna say. So she said this place is good, and Eddie, Eddie is is the guy that I made friends with because he and I had some. Uh, the funny thing is, I, I got this at a coffee plantation, where where their wild cats poop out coffee beans, and for some reason they also make arak. <laughs> so this is actually targeted to Australia. This company. So this is the company. Arak is like Guan, a generic term. That's a company. Guan Guan Hu. Founded in 1920. In Bali Island, which is well known for land, blah 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 blah. blah. What really sucked is I went to video Eddie and I drinking it there at the coffee plantation, and my finger must have accidentally hit the button again, so it didn't record it. I was so typical, upset. Typical. I was just so excited to try some, and I knew it was going to be safe because he was drinking it with me. Okay. Because I don't think you can build up a tolerance to methanol. <laughs> can you? Yes, it's called death. <laughs> See? The cheapest, crappiest alcohol you can produce. Uh, so that's great. I feel honored and privileged. Look, I... But let's try it. We had the, we had the worst, uh, worst scotch See, it in was the world. so bad he forgot it. <laughs> so this can't be okay, any worse. Okay, now, hold on. <laughs> it's like beer. It's a beer top. <laughs> no, but it says 40%. No, no, I know, but it's a beer top. Yeah. Is it? It's not, not a twist top. It's not a twist top. Go to the beer opener. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Go to the beer opener. Zoom in. Zoom in. Where's the zoom? I don't know. There it is. Your camera. There we go. Yeah. There we go. Here we go. Stinky tinky. And look, no fizz. <laughs> because there. it's not beer. Okay, now you gotta there. fix it. Now I gotta fix it. Is it? Zoom out. Uh, no, no, wrong way. <laughs> Speaking of the. Coffee that's pooped out. Coffee that's pooped out. Yeah. Good. My brother. Good. This. My brother. Did your brother poop out something? No, but he sent me a uh, a article about uh, 
African gin. Yeah. Where they take elephant dung. Oh. And they clean it. Okay. Like clean all the bad stuff away and they leave the nuts and the berries and the right. grass. And then they soak the gin in that. But now, here's the thing. Because I remember when we were over there, you were supposed to stay away from the elephant dung because there's a certain type of rare bug. That's where it nests. Yeah, I don't so know. so you can't you don't want to you don't want to drive over that or walk on it or kick it or anything. So maybe it's a season. Maybe maybe it's a season when but that bug is elephant dung gin you can purchase. So we are going to have some legitimate. Or I don't know how I'm gonna. I'll need to find a cork. It smells like. It's really not bad. It, it smells kind of nice. I think. It's not good. No. Okay, just a little sip. Cheers. No, Cheers. you can't just. No, I'm not doing the whole thing. Yeah, come on. No, no, no. I'm not doing the whole thing. Really? Yeah, because uh, when I tried it there uh, on the coffee plantation, I, I lost vision for a short while. <laughs> it's really weird tasting, isn't it? It hits your palate. <laughs> oh, God. <That's> so <laughs> oh. But he's not going to die. So... Yeah, it's not good. Cheers. I'm sorry. <laughs> I tried to sell it up, but... This might be worse than the worst scotch. No. Yeah. No. No. I liked it when I was drinking it with Eddie. You must have been like five margaritas in all. <laughs> no. I wasn't. <laughs> oh. I hadn't been drinking yet. Maybe oh. that's why I thought it was good. Oh, that's not good. I'm going to have to start going to better countries. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he is. But look, I have a friend. Oh. My a little bunch of bananas grew again. And that's one big banana. Well, this is this is the flower part. Oh, these are the little bananas here. Yeah, see? As the each petal as each petal falls, it's got little bananas in there that grow. Would they but, be bananas or would they be planted? Well, what's the difference? Get out your Google thing. What's the difference, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? But here, here's a banana. Look, it's almost, it's almost yellow-ish, see? And we're gonna eat this. He's we, gonna eat that. No, I'm not eating it. Yeah, it's a banana looking. Well, it's like a green banana, but look, look at that, look at that. See that on the inside? See, look at that. That looks like rotten. No, that's not rotten. While a banana makes a great raw on-the-go snack, Plantains are usually eaten, aren't usually eaten raw because of the high starch content. It tastes like um, a not ripe banana. An unripe, that's it, unripe. <laughs> there was one really cool thing though. I've already shown it on the videos. Okay. Hendra. Oh, Hendra. the bartender? Hendra, my hero. Yeah, he he's amazing. My wife started to think that I was starting to get a thing for him. You because were. all I was doing was talking about Hendra the whole time. Yeah, and... If you painstakingly watched the 15 minute video to see the cool ending that he advertised, it was pretty cool because it was Hendra throwing bottles around. So you should have waited till the end like I did. Yeah. But yeah. see, that plantain wasn't good. You should wash it down with some <laughs> air act. I just did. Okay. So uh, it is good to be home. Good to see you again. It's good to be here. And good to wish you all happy, happy Friday. Friday.